Let's take a look at an example of using the distance equals rate times time formula to solve an application problem. If you drive 65 miles per hour for four hours, how far have you traveled? Well, our formula is distance equals rate times time. So 65 miles per hour would be our rate and four hours would be the time. So we'd have the distance equals our rate, 65 miles per hour. We'll leave off the units for right now. Times the time, which is four hours. This product will give us the total distance traveled. So let's go ahead and find this product. We'll have 65 times four. That'll be 20, carry the two, that's 24 plus two. So we have 260 miles. It is important to include the units in our final answer and again, the distance would be in miles. It is pretty typical to leave the units off when setting up this equation, but let me just show you real quickly what happens if you leave the units in. We would have the distance equals, our rate would be 65 miles per one hour as a ratio, times the time, which is four hours, written as a fraction would be four hours over one. And notice how the units of hours simplify out leaving us with 65 miles times four, which is 260 miles. But it is very common to leave the units off of our product here and then just make sure that our answer does include the correct units.